Hey guys, and today we're playing Minecraft Pocket Edition, and this is a little bit of a creative world that I created this world, um, today. Yeah, that's when I created this world. I created this world today, and I already did quite a lot of things. Like, first of all, I made a chamber so that people can can't escape so they wouldn't like ruin my world or something see and after that i like put them all the way up here and i don't, I don't really know if this was today or yesterday I, I don't really know but okay so so yeah it's probably yesterday I I have absolutely no idea. So yeah. So these trees over here, so so when they spawn they spawn on this pressure plate with they spawn on this pressure plate which sends them to game mode two and then they have to complete this parkour. So first of all comes a four block jump. Then a two block jump, one block high. Okay. And then just a three three block jump. Um a three block jump and to the to the corner a little bit and then the slime blocks that they jump. And then if they stop they can land on here and they're free. Just just get out of this hole. And I made a huge stairway that goes all the way up here. And happy first of August, guys. See ya. Um, right now it's 9 p.m. Something. So the stairway took ages to make. Yeah, it goes, like, not at height limit, really. But, just like... And then we come across this house which has what you come in there is how is this chicken still cooking it's been cooking for ages and it's never even finished okay we have some things so people can fight with and then over here we've got Ch charles the slime over here as you can see He's Charles, the anvil that I used <laughs> to make, to name him, yeah, just a little, I put him far away so that he would let people to sleep, even though they're not monsters, they're not monsters, and you still have to keep them away, like, little slimes don't count as monsters, they can't kill you, they're too weak to kill you. There's a bed over here, you can only sleep at night, and yeah, and then the challenging part is to get up and down from the staircase, because you can fall off like this. So yeah, what happens, first of all, you can't make a survival world in a in a flat world, so I have had to go, like, like um, I had to change the world to survival, and then just change it, turn on cheats, and then quit the game, and then just put myself in creative mode again, and then that's how I did it. Everybody spawns in survival. Everyone spawns in survival. I uh, this happens at school. Cobblestone generator over here. A lot of trees over here, which makes this place much different. And yeah, over here used to be water, but I got rid of it because I let people cheat a little bit. Over here, when they go near this place, they get shot by skeletons. Um, where did you come from, and how did you get out? the heck how did he get out or did i spawn him out of the box so they 
So they can't reach the skeletons. They can probably reach them to kill them. And yeah. So it will be a challenge. And they have to break the fences to get out. So yeah. With their hands. Probably if they have... There's no pickaxes. I didn't add any. So yeah. We're gonna. We're just gonna keep going and making some builds. Over here we're just gonna... Um, yeah, it was already a multiplayer, um, I don't know if you can, yeah, change it to single player, alright, um, yeah, let's, let's grab a snow block, I always have trouble to find the snow block, pumpkin, let's make a snowman! Yay, we have a snowman. He's probably gonna shoot the skeletons and he's gonna die. Yep, just expected. What the hell are you doing? Just shooting that slime, what the hell? What the hell is your problem? Okay, he's gonna die. He's so gonna die. I know. Look at him. He's just go- Oh my god, did you see his arms? Those were creepy. That is the creepiest arms I've ever seen. They were like, like an arm span. He put his arms in span. In, or how do you say, like, he like stretched his arms out. What the hell? You see that? That is so creepy. Such a creepy. He that is the creepiest thing. Oh my god. That is so creepy. So scary. Oh my god. He just. That, that is such a creepy thing. Like his movements. His arms are so weird. Oh my god. That. Yeah, it's it's really creepy though how his arms are like Yeah. Yeah, let's stop talking about it because I've been probably talking about it for a long time. Is he just gonna go into the lava? Pff, that would be ridiculous. Let's see that again. Don't see anything. Do your arm thing. Oh my god! I don't know why, but it keeps freaking me out like Oh my god, it's so unusual. That walking, though, it's such a creepy. Probably. Is it because he walks in? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. When they move, they like, um... Sometimes when they move, they like, do that arm thing. It's such a creepy thing to see. They just move and wow. Okay, so let's build a house. Um, yeah, I'm gonna make it an obsidian house. So let's choose some things. Um, pressure plates. Some a bed, a colored bed. Yeah, there are colored beds in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Yeah, you already saw that video. Yeah, I couldn't believe it. Okay, one died. That move, those movements are so creepy. There's this baby zombie. Oh my god, look at there. Oh my god, three at the same time. Is he trying to get them? It's so cool, three at the same time. Hmm. Those ones, um, yeah. Let's build a perfect house. Okay. Oh my god. 
I accidentally placed those blocks there, but I was going to place them there anyways. And the bed goes over there. Just, just put that over there. Nope, we forgot something. Okay. Now we can build this house successfully. There we go. And, okay, we're still not done. We still have to do the floor slowly. And you guys obviously know where I'm placing my fingers now. Because of the circle that is, um, that shows up when I, like, the circle is where I put my finger. It's pretty much where I put my thumb and index. So I used my thumb and index to build things, so yeah. My thumb. I use my index more to build and my my thumb to break blocks. Yeah. So yeah. I pretty much use my index to place blocks and my thumb to break blocks. So I just hold it down and it's easy. Yeah, those are the fingers that I use use and and my um left hand thumb. And my left-handed thumb is like is like where it moves the things where I like move myself where where I'm like holding down on the arrows I'm pressing there the arrows that are like on the left hand side yeah make a roof a little bit of a roof. Make a. Oh my god. Forgot something else. Yeah, that was the creepiest thing. Okay. So, yeah. I'm placing these things. Hi, he's just looking out my. He's just outside my window. You want to not despawn Charles. Charles the Creeper. Where did you go, you bastard? You oh my god. No, stop moving around! He's Charles. Oops. Okay. Haven't, haven't finished the roof. So I pretty much did a little bit of a tour. There's not much in this world at all. It's um really small. Oops. Mm. Okay, so I don't think I'm gonna finish this house this episode. I don't even think I'm gonna make another episode because I'm... Um, Oh my god, those bricks! Stairs, like, oh my god, the middle, like, line is really weird. You, you trying to go inside my house. And entities can't fit through iron doors. Through opened ones. Why are you trying to go in my house? He's like, oh my god, stupid! See, so yeah, don't don't use pressure plates in survival with wooden doors. Like, put a pressure plate in front of a wooden door outside. Otherwise, things can come in your house. Use an iron door instead. They won't come through. They can't even get through it. Okay, hopefully I don't have to put any slabs because I made this, like, um, an even amount of numbers wide. Okay, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Um, I don't. I definitely do not have to add any slabs. Okay. So that's that's what I just witnessed like ages ago already. Like it has to be like an even number, 
the width of your house has to be an even number so you don't have to add any s slabs at all because I have trouble sometimes doing that like Okay, I will definitely finish off this house this episode because it's because I'm nearly done the roof and I'm like like completely yeah. These are some it's really annoying to play this game because when you try to like move your move your camera sometimes you can place a block or break one. No, I mean Sometimes you can play accidentally place blocks when you try move around because you can accidentally like like miss the arrows miss the arrows and oh my god I made a little bit of a basement <laughs> let's put that in there don't want any noises to come from my roof like Usually things would spawn in your roof. Okay. Oh my god, this is the hardest part of all, guys. It's like doing the top. It's it's like really retarded. This is the trickiest part. See? This is like how How the hell do you do that? That's such a hard mission. Oh. Wait a minute. Yes! It looks like a slab on top, okay? So, if you enjoyed this quick little video of a little creative one. Uh, I just, I recorded this video because I really wanted to record a video on August 1st and upload it to YouTube because, because it's a new month. Oh my god, they went all the way down there. So yeah, that was so many snowballs. So yeah. So yeah. Thanks for watching, bye.